Hey guys, Alex here. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will be sharing with you a compilation of the houses that we have in Savior Estates. So XE is a very high-end subdivision located in the Uptown area. It is flood-free, 24-7 security, with complete amenities and just a couple of minutes drive to SM City Mall and Pueblo Business Park. So I'm living in the community myself and I love it. I feel so safe and secure. The gym is just, because my husband and I work out, the gym is just a couple of minutes away from our house. It's super convenient. So I almost never have to go downtown unless I have to. So this is actually an updated compilation I made one a couple of months ago, but I update it from time to time because our inventory changes as well. It changes very fast. So let's begin. So the first house that I'll be sharing with you is the 65 million house in Saver Estates Phase 1. It has a lot area of 600 square meters, a floor of 533. It has 8 bedrooms. So if you have a lot of family members, then this house is for you. It has 8 bedrooms, 7 toilet and baths, 3 parking spaces. And it's built to high standards with quality materials used. So this one is in Phase 2 in Saver Estates. The next house is in phase one of Savior Estates. It has a lot area of 503 square meters, a floor area of 300 plus square meters. It has four bedrooms plus a maid's room and five bedrooms plus the maid's toilet and bath. It has two car parking space and it comes semi-furnished. This one is a bungalow unit at 35 million. And then for the next listing, this one is a 364 square meter property with a floor area of 300 square meters. It's a two-story house with five bedrooms. So there are actually two master bedrooms and 5.5 toilet and baths. So meaning five full toilet and baths plus one powder room. It has two car parks and this one is at 35 million and it has a swimming pool. So there are very few houses in Savior Estates that comes with a pool. The next one is in phase two. This one has a lot area of 860. And another another thing to note is that this is a ridge lot property, which means you have the amazing view of Makahalar Bay. It has a floor area of 1,000 square meters. It is three stories. It's actually a ginormous house. It has five bedrooms, seven toilet and baths, a two car parking space. This one is at 60 million. This one is another rich fee house. These two houses are actually just beside each other. Again, amazing view. It is again three stories, so actually two stories with a roof deck. And then the lot area is 810 square meters. Floor is 950 square meters. It has three very spacious bedroom plus a huge study. So the study can actually be converted into a fourth bedroom as well. And it was built in 2018. It has a two-car parking space. And what I love about this house is the detail that's put into it. You can really tell that it was made with love and care. The walls are hand-painted. You should, you should see my video of this property. The walls are hand-painted. So much detail has been put into designing and making this house into a reality. So this one is at 49 million. Of course, again, the view of this property is just amazing. And then this is a new listing that we have. The next house is in phase two. So it has a lot area of 359 square meters, floor area of 287 square meters, four bedrooms, four plus one toilet and bath. It's newly built, just last year long. And it has a two car parking space. The master bedroom of this house is on the first floor. This one is at 23 million. And the next listing has a lot area of 300 square meters, floor area of 550 square meters. It has six bedrooms, five toilet and baths, and the living and dining area are huge. Like it's super spacious. This one has two car parking space. This one is at 28 million. Now for the next house, this one is in phase four. It has a lot area of 150, floor of 227 square meters. It has, it's a two-story house. Well, basically basically almost three stories in the shop because the attic is on the third floor already. Four bedrooms, three plus one powder room. Built in 2021, has two-car parking space and it's also semi-furnished. This one is at 12.9 million. The next house is in phase four. It has a 300 square meter lot area. So the owner actually bought a 150 square meter lot first, built a house, and then bought the lot next to it. So my extra lot China 150 square meters that's not used or it's being used as parking space. It has four bedrooms, three toilet and baths, three car parking space, 
and it's at 60 million. And another bonus of this property is like sa likod ng property is open space na. So the owner nga put like a couple of chairs, you know, so she can chill in the afternoon. So it's really great to be able to be next to open space since you can use the open space, but you can't build anything permanent on it. But if you just put a couple of chairs and tables, then usually it's fine. And then the next house is, this one is along the main road. It has a lot area of 200 square meters, floor area of 245, four bedrooms, three toilet and baths, one car parking space. This is at 13 million. And then the next house is a 150 square meter lot property with a floor of 248, five bedrooms, four toilet and baths. It has one car parking space at 10.5. And the next one is has a total lot area of 408 square meters. So there are two lots beside each other. So kinumbay ng owner, total of 408. Floor area is 200 square meters. Three stories. Total of seven bedrooms, five toilet and baths, one car parking. Well, you can actually utilize the lot beside it to park more cars if you want to. And it also comes furnished as well. So this one is 17.8. And then for our next house, this one is in phase four. Lot area is 200, floor is 180 square meters. It has five bedrooms, three toilet and baths, one car parking space. This one is at 12 million. And then the next house has a lot area of 200 square meters, floor of 178, five bedrooms, three toilet and bath. It is near the phase four gate and Roseville School. Car parking spaces is around two to three cars. And then this one is at 10 million. And then one of my favorite listings, this is a house with a pool. I love how it's designed. Actually, I also love that it has a pool. It has a big lot area, 450 square meters. Floor is 960, so it's a very spacious house. The rooms are huge. I also have a video tour of this property. Please check it out. It has six bedrooms, good-sized bedrooms, yeah, not the small ones. Six good-sized bedrooms, five toilet and baths, two-car parking space, 32 million. It's already semi-furnished as well. And then next house is sits on a 200 square meter lot area. Floor is 300 square. Bedrooms four bedrooms plus one maid's room. 4.5 bathrooms. One parking space. It's also furnished and it's also near the phase four gate. This one is at 15 million. And then another house in phase four. This is a solid deal because it's a two in one house. So. There's only one photo here, but there's actually a small guest house beside this property. So you will get now the two houses at the price of one, for the price of one. I also have a video tour of this. So this first house sits on a 150 square meter lot and then beside it is another guest house. Same lot area, 150 square. The floor area of the main house is 120 plus. The floor area of the guest house, which is a bungalow, is at 45 square meters. The main house has three bedrooms plus a maid's room for a toilet and baths. It also has an attic and one car parking. It's at 11.5 million. And then for this brick house in Saber Estates, this one comes with a spacious lot area of 150. So the house is built on a 150 square meter lot and then they got also the adjacent lot. That's also 150 square meters next to it and they just like made it into a very spacious yard. So you can convert it into parking if you have like more cars or you can build a pool or whatever you want to construct beside the house. It has three bedrooms, two toilet and baths, one car parking, and it's at 15.5 million. Now for the pre-selling projects, we actually have Skyline Residences. So they offer either lot only or with building. So if with building, it's at around 20 million. If it's lot only, it's around nine to 10 million. So it's a mixed use development. I have a whole video on what the shop house is. So it's a mixed use development. You have to use the first floor at, for commercial use. And the second and third can either be for commercial office space or residential use. So you can like live on the third floor and then use the first floor for business. And then second floor can be your office. There was like a three in one ng, uh, ng property. So uh, it's for mga millennials or those who are like very business minded who have businesses to run so you can like put it all in one space and then we have ventura residences so we have um, a house available this one is a corner lot property in ventura at 8.5 it has a lot area of 176 a floor of 103 square meters five bedrooms three toilet and baths one car parking space so this one is at 8.5 and then another corner lot in Ventura at 8 million with a lot area of 145, a floor of 137, three bedrooms, three toilet and bath, one car parking. So most units in Ventura have one car parking space unless na it's a unit that you built yourself, you designed yourself. 
And then another one is 6 million. So this is actually the most affordable listing that we have in Ventura, 6 million, or in Savior Estates in general. It has a lot area of 110, floor of 110, three bedrooms, three toilet and baths, one car parking, 6 million. And then this one is a newly built house in, again, in Ventura. It has a lot area of 110 square meters, floor of 100 square meters, three bedrooms, two toilet and bath. And it has like a pocket garden in the center of the house, a very unique feature. And then this property is for Ashum. So by the Ashum, or you can like pay out the entire thing. So this one has a lot area of 110 square meters, a floor of 80 square meters. It has three bedrooms, two toilet and baths, is at 5.8 million. And then we go to Savior Estates Phase 6, Ignatius Enclave. So it has a lot, this property has a lot area of 100 square meters, a floor of 69 square meters, two plus one bedrooms. So two bedrooms plus one maid's room and then 2.5 toilet and baths. So modified kitchen, covered parking na siya. It's at 5.5 million. And then our next listing has a lot area of 100 square meters, a floor of 69 square meters, two plus one bedrooms, two plus one bathrooms. It's fully fenced already, modified extended unit, comes semi-furnished. This one is at 6 million. And then we have a pre-selling property in Ignatius Enclave. So what's good with pre-selling properties is that you can just pay the reservation fee, which is 100,000, and the equity can be paid in installment. So this one has a lot area of 120 square meters, a floor of 117 square meters, three bedrooms, two toilet and baths, it's 7.5 million. And then lastly, we have Adelaide Parkview Residences. So Although this is not in Savior Estates, we just included this in the compilation because same developer is still developed by A. Brown. So this one has a lot area of 120 square meters, floor area of 110, has three bedrooms, three toilet and baths, plus one car parking space. So this one is at 6.2 million. And that's it for today's update on the houses that we have for sale in Savior Estates. If you're interested in checking out any of these listings, and just send a screenshot to me and I can schedule a viewing. And of course, if you'd like to be updated of the newest listings, newest projects in CDO and Davao and surrounding areas, just send me an email so I can add you to my mailing list.